G'day ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. Today, thank you for clicking on that thumbnail and tuning in with us. Today, I bring you absolute chaos. Uh, if you were here thinking you were going to find a nice, subtle, little, gentle fuzz, um, you are very, very mistaken. This thing is completely, completely off the charge. This is the uh, little tiny smalls version from Way Huge of the Stone Burner. Now, this is just the most incredible fuzz. It can just be a normal fuzz or it can just be something completely out of control. And I can't quite get my head around it, but uh, I'm trying my best. So, I'm just letting you know, I'm going into the katana. <laughs> That's all I've got. Everything else is coming from this box, from the stone burner. Now, it doesn't matter if you've got the fuzz all the way down, there's still heaps of fuzz when you turn it on. Turning the fuzz all the way up will actually make it lose its mind, which is amazing. Back to about halfway. way down playing around with your volume knob will not clean this pedal up it just makes it sputter and die which is a super cool effect all by itself But at no stage does it actually clean up, which is so good. Right, as for the tone knob. There's so much saturation in the clipping of this pedal. It's fascinating. Tone back at 12 o'clock. All the way down. Right, now where this pedal really starts to bring just enormous amounts of chaotic sonic goodness is when you wind in the sub octaves. Now there is one octave up, uh, down and two octaves down. You can switch between them. But I'll just dull, I'll just hit a note and hold it and then I'll dull this in and you listen to what happens. It is absolutely chaotic. <laughs> It's like the old Boss OC2 Octave, how it just can't track more than one note at a time.
never the same twice. The glitches are never the same twice, which is what makes it awesome. I'm going to flick it down to the sub two octave. <laughs> That's a one sub octave down. Back down to two sub octaves. Now, as you can see there, I've turned the volume down. So even though there is actually a volume for the sub octaves and a volume for the pedal, it doesn't, uh, when you've got it turned down, it turns a whole lot down. I reckon Way Huge have just missed a little trick there. I reckon they could have made them separate so you could bring them in at separate uh, volumes, but anyway. Tracking is very quick. Back up the one up there. <laughs> it sounds like it's dying when you roll your volume down is just great. Well, there you go. This, there you go. this is the uh, the stone burner from Way Huge. This is part of their uh, smalls collection. So it's very, very small. Um, it's smaller than a boss pedal, but I'll tell you what, the, the absolute searing heat that comes out of this pedal is absolutely fascinating. Um, I'm gonna go throw a bass guitar into it now and see what happens. So uh, if you've got this far, Thank you very much. Um, we would also like to thank Way Huge very much for sending this as part of uh, the Jim Dunlop family of companies. Thank you very much for supporting the channel. You've been a great support for a very, very long time. So um, give us a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Anything like that really, really helps our channel a lot and doesn't cost you a cent. So um, thanks for your time. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.